Hey, this is Paul from Wondershare Mobile Trans, the best and easiest tool for transferring your data between two smartphones. WhatsApp is easily one of the most popular ways to communicate, especially internationally. But for a lot of users, especially those switching between an Android device and an iPhone, they may run into some trouble when it comes to transferring their data or their backups between an iCloud account and a Google Drive account. And so today's video, we'll be taking you through a few easy steps in order to transfer the data between those different backups. Before we dive into that, if you find these kind of videos helpful and you want to stay up to date with all the latest tips and tricks for transferring data between your smartphones, be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Getting back to the topic, a lot of users have been searching for ways to easily transfer their data from an iCloud backup to a Google Drive account or vice versa. And when looking for direct ways to do so within WhatsApp, it might seem impossible. Whether you're an Android or iOS user, Google Drive is one of the best tools for backing up your data, whether it's from your phone, your PCs, or other devices. And with its built-in integration with WhatsApp on Android, it's also a great and easy way to back up your chats directly within the app. That said, when it comes to switching from your Android to your iPhone, the encryption protocols between Google Drive and iCloud are different, and so you won't be able to directly use the backups from one device to the other. So what are your options? Because of the incompatibilities between your iCloud and your Google Drive backups, we'll need to use a third-party tool. To begin with, if it's not already, we're gonna reinstall WhatsApp on our Android phone, and then we're gonna perform a backup to Google Drive. After doing so, we can continue with the transfer process, but let's first take you through those beginning steps. First, we're gonna restore a WhatsApp backup to our Android phone through Google Drive. Google Drive is one of the easiest and safest ways to back up large amounts of data to the cloud with ease. In fact, I have over 18 terabytes on my personal account. One of the main benefits of being able to back up your WhatsApp chats as well as other account data to the cloud is that you can access it remotely from anywhere. Their free storage tier, which anyone can sign up for, comes with 15 gigabytes of data, which should be enough for most users, especially again, if you're just backing up casual data, whether those are your chats, a few songs, a few videos, nothing too big. Be sure to use the same phone number and Google Drive account when doing this backup and restore process because we need to have that same login information when we switch over to iPhone. We're gonna reinstall WhatsApp on the Android phone in order to bring up a fresh backup from Google Drive to the Android device. We'll then launch WhatsApp on the Android phone and tap the three dot menu on the right corner. Tap settings and then select chats. Go to chat backup, select backup to Google Drive. You may then be prompted by Google Drive to accept some settings. Tap the allow option when it pops up in order to continue. If we're planning on switching to the iPhone, we only really need the chat backed up once, but you need to make sure you at least select that backup once when I click backup option. We'll now see the green backup button to back up our chats immediately. And now that we've taken you through the steps for backing up your WhatsApp chat data from your Android phone to Google Drive, we'll now be showing you how you can use a third party tool to transfer that data to an iPhone. If you're like me and you're frequently switching between an iPhone and an Android device, you'll find these steps very useful. We'll be showing you these steps using our mobile trans WhatsApp transfer tool. Our powerful tool will let you transfer your WhatsApp backups from your Android to your iPhone in just a few clicks. And so again, if you're looking to switch to a new device, whether it's an Android or an iPhone, there'll be a sigh of relief knowing that you don't have to lose all that data. So let's go ahead and show you those steps. After installing, launch Wondershare Mobile Trans. Connect both your Android and your iPhone to your PC or Mac. From the main screen, select WhatsApp Transfer, and then select the WhatsApp Transfer option. Wait for both your Android and your iPhone to be detected. In this case, since we're transferring the data from our Android device, we want that to be on the left side as the source device. The iPhone will be on the right hand side as the destination, as that is where we want our data to be transferred to. You can either keep all the WhatsApp data, or you can select the individual kinds of WhatsApp data that you want included in the transfer process. You'll see a confirmation screen letting you know that the restore has been completed. Now that you have your old data from your Android phone transferred over successfully to your iPhone, it should automatically be synced to iCloud without even needing any settings done. However, if you notice it's not automatically syncing, there are a few steps you can take. Open settings on your iPhone and tap on your name. Scroll down the menu and you'll see the iCloud option. Choose iCloud and switch iCloud drive to on if it's not. Make sure backup to iCloud is on and then you can click backup now. And this is where under the options for iCloud backup, you can see which apps are being backed up to your account. If WhatsApp is not automatically selected for whatever reason, we need to make sure that we do select that. After doing so, we can perform a backup right now, and then we can make sure that a backup is performed on our regular schedule if we want. So there you go. That's how you can transfer your WhatsApp account, your backups, and your chats from an old Android device to your new iPhone without having to lose anything. And now you can have those same backups that you originally had on Google Drive now syncing to iCloud. Switching back and forth between devices can be a little bit tedious, but using the right tools like Wondershare Mobile Trans can be an easy way to do so. Thanks again for watching this video. This has been Paul from Wondershare Mobile Trans. We'll catch you in the next one.